Hey guys, Mike here. It is hot as hell out this week, so I'm after working all day, don't exactly feel like going outside to film any shooting videos. So instead, we're going to be doing some hunting in Way of the Hunter here on Aurora Shores. And we are actually, I'll show, right here in the Plimbalt Range Highland Forests. Do some glassing along this ridge, one of my favorite places to hunt, for see if we can find some sea deer, uh, barren ground caribou, wolves, black bear, anything like that. I've got the 270 and the 300, so I've got a marker out already. I just want to check this lake before I go walking off, because sometimes there are deer here. Not today. Must they're like right there, but nah, not today. So we'll head up that ridge and we will see what we can find. Alright, we've got a deer call. Just as we're pushing up towards this ridge. They're quite a ways out though, so I'm not too worried about spooking them. Just try to stay downwind and get a good vantage point. I'm not sure if we might actually have to go down into the valley to try to flank them. I'm not sure where. Oof, and elk. Okay. Pretty good morning. Push up to the edge of this road and I'll kind of evaluate the situation. No visual on the deer. Uh, I don't quite remember where the elk were now. Uh, somewhere down here. I think a lot of this we just are gonna have to creep up to the ridges. And hope for the best. Oh, and just place it down there. Holy cow, we got just a smorgasbord. I think I'd really like to see if there's an okay looking elk. I've really just been trying to kill matures, but... And I have been playing the game quite a bit, just haven't really been recording it. Of course, we've been focusing on some other stuff on the channel. But we do have the new African map coming up, so I'm pretty excited to see what their take on it is. Uh, I definitely think if anyone's going to do it justice, they can definitely do a Safari and Plains game map really well. And of course we'll be getting compound bows. I'm not sure if we'll be getting any additional rifles or any um, additional features. Oh, there we go. Oh, and there's this, the deer. That guy. Not too star mature. Sure, female. Young female. Is that another two star mature or the same one? One star adult. And another mature. What do we got down below here? Big herd elk. Uh, I got one young. One young. One young, one young, two star mature, and a one young. Well, wow. that's a lot of young bulls in that herd. And I think that tells me that this older one has probably lived his life. It's time for him to step aside. So I can get a shot with no cow behind him. I think I'll go ahead and take him. 
here, here. Be a tad high. Oh, no, he looks to be hit hard. Watch him. Yeah, he's gonna go down. All right. What are the chances those, oh my God, those deer did not flee. Okay, so I've got a visual. See if we can take that mature out. <sighs> Perfect. Really didn't expect them to still be there, but that worked out okay. Yes. Okay, Don't know how. It looks like you had horns, but that little four corns. Heart shot. Thank you. All right, now we'll head down and grab that elk. If I can kind of pick up where he's at down there. Didn't really go very far. We'll just walk back down there. Probably should have dropped the marker on him first. I've been playing a lot of Call of the Wild and haven't really uh, been in here in a hot minute. Kind of why I figured I'd hop in. After a stupidly long search, we have found him. Is it a single lung? Oof, that took it. Quite a long time in real time. I had to actually go to the other ridge and glass back to try to pick up, uh, pick him up. So there's too much brush on this side looking for him. But mission accomplished. We got him at least. So now we can keep heading down the ridge. See if we can find some. What do we got there? Wild duck. See if we can find some uh, barren ground caribou. Maybe a different herd of elk that's not all young. Maybe some more deer. Okay, there we go. Barren ground caribou. He is 300 yards. Ooh, looks like the... He's going to be on the other side of this little rise. Thinking we climb and shoot down. I guess we could also try to cross, but I've already committed. Gonna hope we don't jump right on top of them. We're closing in now. That's where it's advantageous to cross and, and look from the other side, but I don't want to just keep spooking those elk. I think we should be okay. 
as long as they're not occluded by brush. And as long as there's one worth taking. Okay. Maybe right down in that little clearing, hopefully. Start glassing. They are going to be at relatively close range. I'm trying to stay low. And they're probably going to be occluded. Oh, nope, there's one in the open. Young male. Another one right there. Another young male. Okay. It's going to be a game of trying to spot some the trees. Alright, this might be a waiting game. Oop, we got a young female. I think the young male that was in the trees was a little bigger. Yeah, they're all just exit in the trees. That's mature. One star, mature. Definitely one that I want to take out if I can stop falling. I'm not going to ever stop falling, though, apparently. Look how I'm falling on a surface that is just barely an incline. Okay. Kind of a heavy angle, but I don't want to spook them. Alrighty, I think that is going to be my shot. And off they go. Another 300 wind mags a little big for them, but it doesn't run. That's actually a really big herd. They're going everywhere now. They are long gone. Oh, I got a good spread of animals. Hopefully there's some better genetics in that herd than this guy, but... Well, I will take a wolf whenever I get a shot at a wolf. This is definitely overkill. <sighs> but that was just too easy of a shot not not to take. and I was like, I gotta get out of the screen and see if I can pick one up real quick. I'm always content with any wolf I can get. Just I hit you. Right square in the face. Yeah, that's why I used the 300. It's 
still plenty enough to kill them. But, I think we'll go ahead and call it there. If you guys like videos like this, I do them a little less frequently now, but they're still here. And if you guys like my shooting and hunting videos, those will be coming plenty more too. Big plans, uh, hopefully, coming up. Like and subscribe, and I will see you all next time.